So tell me what you want, what you really, really want. I'll tell you what I want, really, really, really want. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna. If you wanna be Peggle. Peggle. <sighs> well, it's been about just over three years since I played Peggle, and now I'm playing Peggle, the original Peggle. Well. Peggle Lux. The long story. Let's see. The Peggle Institute Certificate of Admission. Enter name here. Now, obviously, we have a long running. We have a long running theme here. So it's it's pretty. It's actually a joke that's been going on for quite a while now. And you know, and and hey, if you're familiar, you'll 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 know the jokes. You, you already know what I'm about to what I'm what I'm about to type in here. Uh, that of course being the 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 classic name Mr. Pegs with a Z. Uh, as to note his incomplete and utter coolness. And we are approved uh, to join the, uh, enroll in the Peggle Institute. Uh, a brief introduction to Peg, 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 Peggle. Do I need to read all this? Like it's Peggle and it, like there's, what, yeah, well, let's just, let's just play Peggle. It's Peggle, we you get the idea. You hit all the orange pen, pegs and you have 10 shots. Gotta love this music though, it's classic. Do 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 Oh dude. Oh wait 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 Oh dude that's a that first shot's bloody perfect. Yeah, I I I think I'm uh getting back I got my I think I got my Peggle groove back. Now Peggle is a very um unique game, because you know, over the years in gaming we've had like, you know, a million Marios, 10 million Call of Duties, and like, you know, 100 million Minecrafts, but there's only ever been one Peggle. Well, okay, there's been Peggle, there's Peggle, and then there's Peggle Deluxe, and then there was Peggle Knights, and there was Peggle Extreme, Peggle World of Warcraft, Peggle, um, oh. <laughs> Wait, get, I, I gotta fix with this. Uh, let's see. That should do it. Okay. <laughs> I forgot that music volume and fever volume are different sliders. I love pedal. I love the little ball flying around. If the first words that come out of my newborn child's second newborn child's mouth aren't I love Peggle, then let's just say, uh, uh won't be going into the free ball bucket if you if you get what I mean. <laughs> oh shit, that was kind of <gasps> oh. I'd probably throw out all of my freedoms uh, if it meant I got to play Peggle, just for shit like that. That's that's awesome, dude. Oh shit. Ooh. That's two free balls. That's oh, yeah, eighty nine thousand points. Now here's the thing. Here's the wait. No, no. I feel like oh, oh. I've got an idea. You see, okay. There's like sort of a line here. Like, see. Oh, yeah. You can see my mouse. So the the pe orange peg's here, right? And you can draw a line from down here with the mouse down to around here. You throw it. This is perfect. Okay. Here we go. Okay. No. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm gonna try from this side. No, 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 this, is, this side's the better side. Wait, hold on. <laughs> hold on. Hold on. I, I just gotta do that again because that ball, that peg was the only thing blocking that shot from. Okay, just hold on. It'll, it'll, uh, it'll work itself out. Perfection takes time. Practice makes perfect. Oh my! <gasps> what? Um, I, I, uh, uh. This is what you do. This is what you do. You sort of put this like this. Oh 
God damn it. Oh, my hands, my head's in my hands, dude. <laughs> Did you see how close the ball got to that, to the orange bag? It almost worked. It almost bloody worked. Look, I'm not saying that I'm gonna get myself trapped, like, like doing that ever, like, you know, again. Uh, and the only reason why I say that is because if the opportunity ever presents itself, I know I'm gonna get it on the first try. Hmm. Alright, so what you do is, okay, here's the, here's the, here's the idea. So, this spot peg to the, that peg over there, and then from that peg, it goes down to that orange peg that's just in between. As you can clearly see. As you can clearly see, it works every goddamn time. I, 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 I what else do I even have to say? Okay. <gasps> Holy shit, guys. We're in the real shit now. It's Jimmy goddamn lightning. It's Jimmy Rutherford, Jim Jonathan, Lightning Ford, the third. Piece of shit. Also, um, did I just go insane or did his thing not play at all? His, why did his, his theme didn't play at all? Why didn't it play? I hate that it doesn't play the sound. That's like the only reason why you play as Jimmy. Maybe I'll edit it in. Also, I mean, it it sucks. It's like a really bad power. Okay, I can be. I can. I can full clear this level. Let's uh. Let's do this. And now I have to just sink this purple. Oh, it's just it's just that easy. I wasn't even I wasn't even trying mind you. I was actually I Mean the the blindfold definitely I thought was gonna like stop me from being able to do something like that I guess it just doesn't matter. I think I, I guess it just snail All right, hold down the right mouse button to speed up time. No, I know I know I'm acutely aware Just like the fact that this owl is acutely aware that 99.99% of the entire world's population are subscribed. But that 0 .001, I'm at to gut, I'm at to bloody get you. I, I don't know where you, I don't know, what's that Liam Neeson thing? I don't know who you are, or what you're doing, or what color, uh, clothes you're wearing or the size of your hands i don't know any of that stuff but uh i'll find you and i will i'll i'll, I'll beg please <laughs> please for the love of god please this is the this is the old uh caged bird trick Let's see it works every time and then pop out the bottom i guess that's more of like a I could I could have made like a, a digestive system joke. Oh, damn it! That was literally like a free a free poop joke, and it would have been hilarious, as they tend to be. Oh, I know he. This is a dude. I always thought this guy. This was a um a girl cat when I was a kid, but I mean his name's Cat Tut, which is a pun on King Tut. A horrible pun on King Tut, but it's a pun. It's a pun on King Tut. I mean, really, really could have just. Made made him a girl and called him Cleopatra, but I mean, like, you know, all, like, all all bets are off. I mean, it's been what like 20, 20 years by now, so like I, I I guess there's really just no, you know, we we gotta look, we gotta live with the mistakes we've made, I guess. I've never mentioned the pyramid sucks dick because it sucks dick. It just sucks. It's horrible. It's it's the worst. It just it I I literally rather not have it because I couldn't do this. With the pyramid. <laughs> I can't believe I got that on the first try. try. This level sucks. I hate this level so much. I got four balls left. Look at how many orange pegs there are. I want something else to get me through this. Send me some kind of line. Baby, baby, huh? Listen to you say. Goodbye.
<laughs> I think I did that. I did a, uh, that song and I forgot what that name, the song's called. Uh, but I'm pretty sure their, their BPMs, they match literally perfectly. I, I don't think I had to even edit it. It was like perfect. I think I might still have it somewhere on my hard drive. It's like scarily like s similar. The goal of this level is to not fall into the stupid goddamn V. It sucks. This level sucks. This is probably the worst set of levels in the game. I hate these levels. <laughs> oh, hey, this is that little, this is little, this is that huge block. I think I've referenced this in the Peggle Knights thing. This block is just bloody huge and I don't, it's, it's massive. Look at how big it is compared to the other ones. Look at these bricks down here, and then look at that brick. That's just so unfair that those are like compared bricks. I mean, I don't think, you know, in, like you know, we should really be judging them based off of like the, I guess the 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 size. Like they're just bricks, you know. Like they're not. I think the value sort of comes more in the uh, the placement and the way they're used. So this green peg, uh, in story mode, there's a couple of intentionally placed pegs. That will be like that every time, assuming you're playing adventure mode. That green peg is one of them. It will always be in that exact spot. Oh, oh, okay. No, I got this. Watch, it's gonna hit that peg and then, hmm. Okay, wait, hold on. <gasps> oh. <laughs> There's the green pig's back. Look, I I told you, it stays at the same place every goddamn time. God, it's bloody hot right now. Fun fact, Australia is within the top uh, one percentile of um, literal hottest places in the entire goddamn world. At least that's what the uh, the article was titled. Oh, it's the, uh, it's the flinch. This is, um, this guy's an offensive stereotype. So instead of um, reading his, instead of reading his lines, uh, in an offensive and demeaning accent, I'm instead going to read it, um, uh, the way I would read it. Um, allo, je, ma, appel, Claude. Zat means I am Claude in your English. Maybe I should do like... Have you tried the flippers? Ah, they are wonderful, mate. With, the, with them you will learn... This is really hard. <laughs> Skip it, who cares? <laughs> oh god. We're gonna be here for a while. God, that was bloody boring. Why did I do it, you ask? Well, it's just, it's just a little something called efficiency over comfort. Uh, Seika Bliao, that fish is in your way. Hit him to convince him to move. What if I don't wanna? Sorry, fish, I didn't mean to hit you. <laughs> I like the little flip sound. I wonder if that's the only time in the game files that that uh, s sound effect is used. It might be a menu sound effect, actually. Wait, let me hear it again. That sounds like a menu sound effect. I'm pretty sure it is. What, a what the hell? 
Oh, Yui, oh, Yui, these waves are tricky. Take your time, and you'll do fine. I don't know why he's uh, talking like that. Oh! Alright, two balls left. Perfect, right? I, I don't I, I can just use both on each one. Mm -mm. No, that's not how it's going to happen. Perfectly line it up. Oh, and he does it! Holy shit, I did not think that was going to work. Oh my god. Okay, I don't know what the hell they were thinking. Making this level for the bloody flippers. If they're horrible. They're horrible for this stage. They work. They work in some stages. I'll definitely say that they're not the worst ability in the game. But in this stage, they're bloody horrible. I don't- is it- this feels like a goddamn Seinfeld bit. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I'm inflect inflecting my voice like that. Oh, yes, dude. The game can finally begin. If you don't know, Renfield is by far the second best character in Peggle. He's, I think he, he's probably the best, if not the second best. His power is basically Jimmy Lightning's multi-ball, uh, except it's actually good. That footage was a horrible demonstration of that fact. I mean, do I have to even- do I have to explain this stuff? I mean, I don't know, like, I- 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 I mean, it's just- it's just good. Oh, it's a snake. You know, this little swirly effect in his eyes, it's meant to be like hypnosis, but it reminds me of the- the candy from Cut the Rope. It kind of looks like that. It's got a similar color scheme. At least I remember it having a similar color scheme. I haven't played Cut the Rope in bloody ages. Oh yeah, this level, all of these pegs, all of the V in this V shape and the eyes are all uh, coded to be not orange pegs. Uh, the reason being is like the intended strategy is to sort of break this net, essentially with the spooky ball. Now that last orange peg, this is not a good position. I don't think I can get it at all. I think... Oh, oh, joy. I'm onto the bloody flower. Oh, bruh. Look at this little bloody peeping Tom down here. What a creepazoid. <laughs> if one... If one video game character came into the real world and it's that... It was that guy... <laughs> That'd be so disappointing. Like, oh, I guess that is a thing that can happen, but it didn't ha it didn't happen with anyone even remotely known or interesting. It happened to a bloody cat a, a bloody caterpillar that appears in Peggle. <laughs> what a waste. This stage does not usually treat me well. Also, there's a bear here. And now that I've acknowledged the bear and pointed out the bear, you could say that now all of you have bear in mind. I've I've full cleared one level so far. I'm on level what? What is this? Like 38? And I've I've full cleared one level. What kind of goddamn peggle player am I? Maybe that blindfold is is I'm still wearing it. it I don't know, maybe it's not as good as I thought it was. No, I get so reckless in levels like these. I just do whatever the hell I want. Oh, dude, it's the old goddamn birdcage trick. Coming back again. <gasps> oh, shit. I pulled that around real fast. Look at that. Don't call it a goddamn comeback. The libs are after your pegs. Lock up your ball jectors and seal up your fever meters because now the liberals want your peggle too they're gonna change the name to they them go 
Warren's the best character, assuming your RNG is good. Hell yeah! The, ma the magic hat adds a hitbox above your ball that makes it a million times better. So, you know, it, depending on your luck, this could either be the easiest world or the hardest world. And so for me, it's obviously going to be the easiest world because I'm perfectly lucky. I haven't been one unlucky once in my entire life. By the way, shout out to the best superpower in the entire world, which is luck manipulation. The ability to bend luck to your will. If you think of the amount of things in the world that could theoretically happen if the circumstances line up just correctly. Imagine being able to manipulate luck so that that, can, that just happens. It's the, it's the perfect superpower, really. You could win every dollar, and you could have, you could be the richest person on Earth. Like, you can just win the lottery every time. And anything that has a chance of happening can happen, and you can make that happen. It's basically like the superpower equi equivalent of the kid who always wins every imaginary fight. Oh, multi-ball. Oh shit. Oh no, multi ball sucks. <laughs> the the extra ball I had hit two other pegs. Are you kidding me? Okay. Let's talk about that. So both of my green pegs. In fact, you know, I'm gonna play while I'm talking about this. Both of my green pegs I got I got multi ball. Now, there's a 1 in 4 chance that the wheel lands on the bottom slot. The bottom slot is always another Peggle Master's power. Oh my god. Okay, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. <gasps> oh, look, there's, um, bookworm. There's some bookworm adventures, uh, book, uh, little worms. And up there, that's chuzzle. Those are, th those are chuzzles. Both of those being PopCap games made previously. Oh, shit, that was gonna... Kind of cool. You know, I've gotten to the point. You always start out playing Peggle and you get like the tiniest cool thing. You're like, holy. But then uh, you progress and you, you get humbled a little bit and you and you start to, uh, you know, really ev properly evaluate the shots that you make. <gasps> now we move on to the final master but the second to last world. Master Who. Now, Master Who's power is very interesting because it's basically like uh, downloading a little computer chip into your brain that makes you better at Peggle. Like that, uh, that little Elon Musk thing. Like that little, like, sci-fi data log that he tweeted a couple of, uh, passages of time ago. You see, that's how you make sure a video doesn't get dated. Now, this level is cool. There's a little pog-pog-champing bo bowling ball in the center. Take this. There we go. I don't know how to get this orange peg. Is there any way for me to get this peg? <laughs> I don't think I can get this, or this orange peg. I'm literally getting everything. Okay. I don't think that's possible. I think I was uh, I was stuck there. Even if I got every other peg, I don't think I would have been able to get that. Oh god, it happened again. Look, there's two that are right there. The way that you would get these before wiping out all the pegs is to sort of do it like this. And there you go. If you don't have that option because you cleared every other peg in the entire bloody level, then tough luck, I guess. Oh, though, dude, that's okay. That's a vi video idea, essay idea. Peggle is Peggle was bad, actually, and they don't actually even conclude that the game was bad. They just dance around a couple of 
potential things they think are kind of wrong with the game a little bit. I'm gonna love the set of YouTube content. Not me though. Pumping out high quality Peggle content. And this is what, I, I'm just doing what's been requested of me. And this was, wait, this was requested of me by, hold on. A dear fan who I remember the name of, um, shit, uh, Dom underscore PK. We've, uh, go back, we go, we go way back, uh, me and, oh, shit. Hold on. Dom un underscore PK. You come to me on the day of my daughter's peggle. <laughs> Mafia Peggle. <laughs> you come to me on the day of my daughter's Peggle. Hey boss, we'll break we'll break his copy of Peggle for her, eh boss? Yeah, boss, we'll break his copy of Peggle. Then he won't have then he won't have any any he won't have any Peggle to play, right boss? Now boys, let's let's go easy on him. We're gonna break all of his peggle. I still really like the line. <laughs> you come to me on the day of my daughter's peggle. <laughs> Cause it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> yeah, that was kind of cool. Pretty nice. Like what the hell am I supposed to do here? I have two balls left, there's four pegs. Like, god damn. I don't even think... Oh, yeah, you do that. That's what I, I mean, see, that's what I'm talking about where it's like, this game isn't, you know, it's it's fully skill-based. Like, you know, I only achieve that because of how good I am at Peggle. And now, I've completed the Peggle Institute's undergraduate program with determination and flair. And all that remains is the final exam. But first, I, uh, I need to, I need to pee. <laughs> oh, no, wait, no, 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 no. Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say, I could just keep doing that over and over again, and then I messed up, but didn't mess up. But... Something. So maybe this isn't the worst stage for the flippers, but it's definitely the worst stage for using, like, the flippers themselves. If that makes any sense. Can we Oh my god. Can we look at that? Look at this. Look at this. Just actually soak it in. Like, just... Oh. Oh. <laughs> Wait a second. This is going back to 2014. Look in the middle. Is that? <laughs> Dude, I remember when that joke was everywhere. That was like, that was huge. That meme was, it was, it went on forever. Dude, It felt like it went on for like five years. Where everyone was making that joke, like, all the time. And you know what? I miss it. I don't think it's probably funny for the right reasons. But it definitely makes me laugh. Damn! Okay, Jesus, that was sick. And that wasn't. But, you know, we... We, uh... Take victory when we can get it. Oh, yes! <laughs> Alright. I know, listen, I know that the ball bouncing off the bucket, it's not a perfect strategy. Oh my, what? Hear me out. Huh? And that is not how you do it. <laughs> Come on. And that is how you do it.
you get the ball in the helix and it rises up and basically hits every single peg. Like anything in Peggle that you thought was cool that you've done, take that and literally add 21 million to it. If you think of the amount of things in the world that could theoretically happen if the circumstances line up just correctly, imagine that just happens. Look, I'm not saying that I'm gonna get myself trapped, like, like doing that ever, like, you know, again. Uh, and the only reason why I say that is because if the opportunity ever presents itself, I know I'm gonna get it on the first try. Should I try and just get the shot? Maybe I should just go for it normally? But on the other hand, imagine how cool that would be. Screw it, I'm doing it. We're gonna figure- we're gonna, we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it. You know what? I'm tired of this. Uh, I'm just gonna beat the level normally, and then I'm gonna show a replay I, I have done before of me doing that trick. You probably saw two seconds of that, and I saw 30 goddamn minutes, if not more. Uh, and I didn't get anything, so... It wasn't fun. Oh god. Am I not- I'm probably not even gonna beat it this attempt. Let's look at this. Beyond this, the tr that's that trick being difficult. This is just kind of a hard level. Of course, with me behind the wheel, it's just as easy as, uh, you know, to pull an, uh, taking the weights off just a little bit. Unleashing about mm, a few percentages more of my full power. We're about to do it. I, I mean, I better not be preempting this a little bit too hard. One final shot, one final peg. Look at that! One peg to rule them all, dude. Oh my god, come on. No. No! Oh god, my last ball. Yes! Today, ladies and gentlemen, we beat Hegel Deluxe. In the easiest way possible. But, you know, we did it. Adventure complete. Retries 94. Efficiency bonus 100,000. Final score 16 million. Not by far, not even close to my best score, but whatever. Yeah. Let it be forever known that in consideration of your hard work and effort, we proudly bestow upon you the rank, title, and prestige privileges of a true Peggle Master. But wait, there's still- oh, I don't care about that. Oh, look at that! My little- my trophy. Maybe it's this one? Oh, here we go. Okay, watch this. Oh. Oh, would you look at that? Oh my god. Woo! Let's just-
just beautiful. It's just beautiful, isn't it? What a sight. I did that once. Not doing it again. <laughs> and that scored me... Well, basically, yeah, 900,000 points. That's gonna be it for Peggle. I made pretty good time. And, um... I don't know how to... How do you... And... Um... If you wanna be my lover You gotta get with my friends Make it last forever Friendship never ends If you wanna be my lover You have got to give Taking is too easy But that's the way it is